Welcome to Walker Hamster. Today I'll be unboxing this Amcrest HD CVI video security system. The model is AMD V1088-4B4D. So that's four domes, four bullets. And let's go over some of my high highlights on the box before I open it up. So it's 1080p, eight channels, 984 feet in total cable length. It supports four terabytes of storage. Also remote view for a lot of popular tablets, smartphones, has night vision, it's weatherproof, and it's a uh, DIY installation system. So for remote viewing, it supports the Google Play apps and as well as the iOS apps. And here's just some examples of 720p resolution and 1080p resolution. Uh, let's look at what's on back over here. So when it's 1080p, 30 frames, it uses the coaxial cable. And just list some contents in the box down here also. Now, here's the important part. Here's the technical specs. So if you want to get down to nitty gritty, I would definitely recommend visiting the Amcrest website because they did publish all their manuals, user manuals, operation manuals, installation manuals. I went through it, it's pretty useful. So for both the bullet camera and the dome, they're both IP66, so what that means is basically it can withstand hurricane type weather. So from the larger box came these four boxes. We have the 1080p channel accessory box here. We have the DVR. We have a four pack of cameras and another four pack of cameras. In each of the two boxes for the HD CVI cameras, we got the two bullets, two domes, and they're very well packaged. Uh, there's nothing on here. So in one of the boxes, it also includes all the screws you will need. It has the user manual, the basic hookup guide, the extended warranty information, and also the screwing for the, uh, well, the image mapping for camera positioning if you need to screw against a concrete wall or something. So these will definitely help you out. And stickers for your home or business. Here we have a dome camera. Right over here it says Amcrest 1080p. Turn this around. Now the power requirement says input is 12 volts, 0.5 amps. And the lens it uses is 3.6 millimeter. Surrounding the lens is the night vision infrared LEDs. Then there's a light sensor right over here. This part is adjustable. The dome is adjustable. And it's screwed on or held against a wall or ceiling or anything by four screw points. If you follow this cable, it's about 50 inches before it splits up to so coaxial. There's a DC port. Then on this one over here, if we read this tag for this brown and white cable, default is HD mode, but if we short these two cables, it will switch to the SD mode. Here we have the bullet camera. It says Ancrest 1080p. On the bottom, it says the input is 12 volts, but it's 0.35 amps, and the lens is also 3.6 millimeter. On the front over here, surrounding the lens are the night vision infrared LEDs. Below it is the light sensor. On top over here, if I loosen this, I can extend the sun shield. Extend it just a little bit or retract it. And this part is a ball joint, so it is adjustable. It's held on to the wall or ceiling by three screws. If you follow this cable 10 to 12 inches before it splits up, now it's here we have the coaxial connection. We have the DC 12 volt in connection. Then we also have the brown and the white cables over here. Where on this tag, it also says the default is HD mode, but if we short these two cables, it will switch to the SD mode. This came in the box labeled TVR. A optical mouse with a USB attachment remote control that takes two AAA batteries but did not come with the AAA batteries the software and also the power adapter so for this power adapter it inputs at 100 to 240 volts 1.2 amps outputs at 12 volts 3.0 amps and here's the type of connection it uses there's also a ground screw so now let's take a closer look at the actual DVR. From the front, we have a number of LED indicators. 
of power, escape function up, down, left, right, then the USB. Turn to the side, just ventilation on both sides. Looking at front and back, we have the ground with the master power on and off. We have a DC input, the network, BGA, USB, HDMI. We have the video in, one through channel eight. Also audio in, audio out. On the bottom of the DVR, there is a QR code. Here's the last box that's labeled 1080p eight channel accessories. We have four different sets of coaxial cables. For these four, these are the 100 feet coaxial cables with power cable. So let's take a close look at one of them. So it's split, here's coax, and here's the power connection. So these are 100 feet. There are another four set of them. These are 60 feet each. For this one right here, this is the power adapter. The squid with eight connections on one side went in over here. So for this, it's input at 100 to 240 volts and at 1.7 amps. The output is 12 volts, 5 amps. Here's the other adapter for this end of the power. Thanks for watching this unboxing of the Amcrest HD CVI video security system. This one's 1080p, 8 channels. It's a DIY system, so I'm um, looking forward to setting this up. The one I got is 4 bullets and 4 domes, and can record up to 4 terabytes. Alright, so if you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching, Walker Hamster. Bye.